Hello, hello, welcome back to some Territorial I.O. on Mountains. Shaking it up a little bit. Not playing one of the more common world maps. But we are playing instead on one of these uh, you know, little Territorial maps that the guy made. That gentleman has a very strong spawn. But he won't have great borders for expansion. That's why we picked this area, because even though there's going to be a couple more players, the expansion routes are way better. Uh, those two will keep themselves busy over on that island, hopefully. And we'll just be able to grab up a ton of land here. Russia's, Russia doesn't know what he's doing, so that's good. He'll be way behind on troops. And we're just going to keep growing steadily here. And uh, America also doesn't really seem to know what he's doing. We've pretty much hit our infinite growth that I learned by watching some of Corgi Circus's gameplay. All right, that's going to be it for land. So let's start hitting some bots. Let's go in and crunch down Russia a little bit since they have no troops. They're still full sending. So we're just getting tons of land here on the hyper cheap. Let's grab all of Russia's land if we can before, my goodness, this is just craziness. Let's just creep grabbing Russia's land before Drew can get any. As he just continues to full send for land. But let's keep it going upwards as well to cut off as much as possible. All right, getting tons of land here at very, very low costs. I just really don't want this gentleman to be able to cut us. Ah, he's going to. Yep, he's going to cut us off from that. We'll be friends. Let's finish this guy off. And now let's, oh, let's get over here right now. Um, let's friend up here. And let's just get a big hit in on this guy right off the bat. Yep, he sends it because he doesn't want us to take it all, but we're going to anyway. Give us all that land, sir. At the cost of two cents. Not bad. Tons of land there. And this guy also has no troops. So we will happily take that from you as well. Okay. All right. So let's take a moment here and let's check out the rest of the world. Uh, that other guy just left. I'm actually going to work on Drew. Because he's getting so much land for free. I can't let that happen. Let's get some of these guys in on it. And, all right, that's all the land that he's going to get. He's going to end up with a couple more troops than us, but not too many more. Um, we really need... All right, Roman Empire is also getting massive. Jews now attacking us back. This guy's got to know. He's got to go in. This guy's definitely going to be fighting the Roman Empire. Oh, this guy attacks. No, 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 no. All right, all right. So the gang up is now occurring. It's gonna need to kick this guy off of us immediately. Let's not fight here. Drew's getting a big troop advantage now, as we've been taking some hits from other people. Uh, let's piece it up with Drew now, if we can. If he doesn't, I wouldn't be surprised. All right, he will truce with us. This guy's attacking us again, so we need to kick him off. All right, he's fighting that guy, so we're going to need to go in here. Let's lessen our sends a little bit here, because Drew has just as many troops as us. Now he wants peace. Can't let it happen. 
Got to take down this gentleman right here. All right. We're getting low on our sends or on our troop count. So let's keep, or uh, on red interest. So let's keep pushing. And we'll take this land. We obviously take land much faster than um, Tio does. All right. So it's just some real solid gains for us. We have the 160,000 troop point. Um, I actually can't attack them. I have to go into Drew here. I have to, because I have to get all this land before um, I touch with Boo. I need Boo to go in here, or I need these two to gang up on them. They gotta do something, one thing or the other. but definitely need to uh, focus on Drew. By far my best borders, by far the best gains that I'm going to be able to get. If I take out Teo, I'm touching everyone, and I die. Uh, I don't know why you're face palming. you know that as well. You know that this is absolutely the best uh, path for me to go. I know it's unfortunate for you, but it definitely is the best path. So... Let's keep on. Oh, that's just, that's, that's very, very bad for us. We need to keep pushing it on him. Roman Empire takes the crown, but that's okay because he doesn't have any troops. Yeah, we'll friend up with you for now. Because even if Drew full sends us, we'll be okay. Need to keep pushing away. Does with the white flag. If you full send me now, that's actually better. We will get more land out of it than the Roman Empire does. All right, Drew's being very, very patient. Roman Empire is just building up troops, building up troops. Okay, Drew attacks us back. Maybe he's starting to get impatient. We'll see. All right, Roman Empire finally gets involved. That's okay. That's actually quite all right with me. Roman Empire cannot make gains against this fast enough, I hope. All right, he was not able to. But if they hang up on me, I can still lose. So I'm going to go into Teo here. And hope that I can take land away from him faster than the Roman Empire can take land away from me. That is my only chance of winning. So let's just keep, let's keep that push going. Roman Empire is dedicating a lot of troops to trying to push me down. It's going to be close. It's going to be close. But I think we've got it. Pretty sure the Roman Empire is spending too many troops on these attacks. And Teo is going down. Roman Empire is sending a lot of troops. A whole lot of troops. So we're both running super low. Do you want a truce now? All right, he truced up, so let's send a hit back in. Yeah, just just attack this guy. Attack this guy, and you can have second. All right, this is still such a close match. Lots of sending back and forth. Let's hit him a little bit bigger. And uh, Teo's just regaining his strength to hit me back. So let's just finish off. All right. Now this is going to be tough because we ended up with a little bit less troops than the Roman Empire and not much more land. Yeah, it's going to be... It's going to be close. 
It's going to be real close. <laughs> We're just like sending the same amount of troops into each other. And no one's making much in the way of headway. Actually, every time he sends, I need to hit him back because he ends up with less troops than me. All right, we're sitting like we're at the same troops. I have a tiny bit more land. And we're just poking each other back and forth. <laughs> poking back and forth. He sends. I send. Now we're build, building up a little bit more. He sends. I send. He sends. I send. All right. Okay. This is one of those tough ones. He's down to 10 million. He's down to 7, 8 million. All right. I think we're finally starting to push away from him a little bit here because he sent a bit too many troops. He's about to be below 300,000. We're up to 330. Push him down a little bit more. He's now below 300,000. And we'll just keep hitting him and keeping him below us in troops. Oh man, we've been fighting too long now. It must have an end. There must be an end. There must be an end. You will, you, you did get second. And he leaves. Perseverance wins it. Very good game played by him. Super, super close. Way closer than I normally see on one of these kind of maps. So that was actually pretty fun. I uh, hope you all enjoyed the video. And, um, you know, like and subscribe for more territorial content. And I will see you all in the next one.